Hi, I'm Nicole. I live in Brooklyn, but I am from Miami, Florida. I'm she, they. Over the five years of doing music photography, like my vibe, like I've always started with Neptune. Like where Neptune comes from <laughs> is, and why I call myself Neptune is essentially my vibe of my photos, like dreamy, like nostalgic, like, and that I think that goes along with my personality as well. I believe like my style and my photos is energy like I have a lot of energy and I love to capture a lot of energy my aesthetic of my photos like my color choices and like editing choices I just really love color I <laughs> I love color and I love maintaining like a dark aesthetic but also super bright and dreamy like and vintagey nostalgic feel but still remains true to like me in my capturing style. I feel like the way I capture a moment is completely more so different than most people. And then my, my editing style, I just really love dark, like black with like really bright colors or pastels. And I see it, I see a lot of my photos almost all the time as I'm capturing or editing as just a composition because I went to, I've like done art my whole life and I went to school for art. So it's just the way like I see things as I'm capturing and as I'm editing. My aesthetic definitely goes back to the whole Neptune thing of what it stands for in astrology specifically would be nostalgia and disillusionment and illusions and dreamy aesthetic. I feel I've pushed against the narrative of like my photos not being editorial enough is I just like don't see it that way. I don't see my photos not being editorial enough. Obviously in this day and age, like we see more and more photographs becoming way more art deco and like, you know, I try not to take it personally. You know, I get it. I get like the whole like clean photo for press and that's, that's great, but it's just not my preferred like I believe in like a really like visually appealing, like for at least in my terms, I guess, <laughs> photo. And that to me is something that's really artful, like visually pleasing. And I push against the narrative every day that my photos are not enough for editorial because I would love to be published. Literally, you just go on Instagram and you see all these super artful like editing style with that you just like you're like how the hell did they do that blur and like super pop pastel color yeah I love to see it it makes me super happy that that type of photography style is getting published and I feel like the right magazines or articles and the ones that people who prefer more artful editorial like avant-garde or whatever photography like those magazines will come, the right magazines will come to you and like want to work with you. I guess in my mind, there's a certain, there's a certain place I want to be at. Like that, I'm not saying that I'm not grateful for the place that I'm at. It's just like, it's, it's definitely a problem of mine where I have to remind myself like, hey, like I'm doing great and for myself right now. And I love doing interviews like this because it then like really gives me time and space to think about like how far I've come and like how much time and effort and like love I've put into making a career out of this because I mean no one in my family has ever done anything like this like so it's really just me being on like on a whim and like really believing in myself oh my god I'm about to get emotional I love it I love everyone's support it's super crazy and I constantly have this renewing dialogue with myself where I'm like what am I doing next year like how am I going to keep growing in my career because now I'm at a point or I've been at a point where I'm like I'm, I'm doing these things that I've literally always said I'm going to do like live in New York put my name out there like really like you know do all these things and then now I'm, at a, I'm constantly at a place where I'm like I need to like think about the next you know move yeah. for myself as an artist yeah. and as a photographer to really get to the place where i I want yeah. to be, which I, who knows, <laughs> who knows what that is. <laughs>